This video will show you how to morph between two different types of lattices. This example will morph between a planar hexagon lattice to a body-centered cubic strut lattice. To start, select the object you want the final lattice geometry to occupy. Convert it to implicit if it's not already implicit. Right-click the body and click copy. Right-click anywhere else and press paste. Right-click again and swipe to accept the pasted transform. Select the first body and apply a planar lattice to it. Choose whatever lattice properties you would like to start the morph with. When you are happy with the first lattice, accept it. Select the other body and apply a different lattice to it, in this case a strut lattice. It's a good idea to have the two cell types have similar properties to avoid any disjointed regions. When you are happy with the second lattice, accept it. You should now have two separate latticed bodies that are overlapping each other. You can toggle the visibilities to check this. Open the Morph tool and select the two lattice bodies to begin morphing. Toggle the field mode for the morph value and create a new field. Let's clear the current driving object and use the global Y plane instead so that we get a gradient from left to right. You can check the gradient visually or edit the properties of the gradient at this point to get what you are looking for. When you are happy with the gradient, accept the field, then accept the morph to finish. You should now have a single body with a lattice that has a gradient between two different types of lattices.